In the last tutorial, I showed you how to configure the toolbox for the first running. And now let's start creating parts. Let's go to the toolbox. And here you see all the standards. I'm going to choose the ASO standard. Here you see the components inside this folder. There is bearings, bolts, keys, and so on. In this tutorial, I'm going to create some bolts. With these bolts, I'm going to use them in some tutorials. So here you have many types of bolts. You have the cross pieces and the structure, screws, and so on. Here you can try to choose them, have a look. The Structural one is almost coming in bigger diameter. Here I'm going to use the hex bolt and screws. Here are the types of this category. Choose one of them. Right click. Here you see the configure. We already know how to configure in the last tutorial. But in this tutorial, I'm going to choose the create part. As you see, SolidWorks created a part. Choose the specification of your ball. I am going to make it M4 with length of 40. The length of the thread. I want it to be 40 as well. Thread display. Here you can have it flat or cosmetic. It's only a picture, it's not a real thread. And here is schematic. You can see a real thread. And then you press OK. So now you have created your part. It is saved in the folder I told you in the previous tutorial you created to save your parts. So if I go to the folder which I created on the desktop, here we have the toolbox parts folder. And here you see the part which you have created. And all these numbers are standard so you don't need to change in them because everything is registered in the toolbox database of SolidWorks so now I'm going to create another hole this time hex flange hole create part and this one I'm going to choose it to be M6 and the length will be 20 thread also 20 and this schematic okay so if I go again to the folder on the desktop you have the bolt you have created so these two bolts I'm going to use in one of the next tutorials So what you can do now is just start experimenting with all these components. Thanks.